So you want to win an NCAA championship. Some think it's easy, and on paper, maybe it is. Just win the next six games in a row, and you've reached your goal. But as Dickie B is going to tell you, these are the toughest six games to play. And you'll see that in today's game between the NC State Wolfpack and the Texas Tech Red Raiders. Hey, Brad, the NCAA tournament is the reward. After a long season of practices, tough games, and all of those other rigors, the tournament is their pinnacle. The Red Raiders are facing very tough opposition tonight, Dick. What's the key to them winning? The keys tonight are very simple. First of all, get the ball inside for the high percentage shot. That'll open up the outside game as well. Second, make good decisions offensively and reduce those turnovers. And lastly, get out of those shooters. Challenge every shot. I think you're dead on, Mr. Vitale. Let's see what happens. Let's get this one started. Trying to feed the low block. A lot of good things happen when you bring the ball down to the inside. Instead of giving him that, use a foul. Both teams looking to get things going here. Keeps the dribble as they set it up again. He takes the three, gets it to fall. Keeps the dribble as they regroup. Boy, it's all elbows and shoulders down there, and I think the defense is winning, Dick. I tell you, doing a great job in post defense. A lot of people don't realize that is an area that has to be taught, and this kid has responded in a positive way. Dumps it in. Good fake. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. He got the steal. The pressure got to the ball handler. Awesome ball pressure. It was too much for him, and he lost possession. He shoots from the top of the circle. Man, he lured the defender to the screen, giving him time to shoot the sweet J. He beats him to the punch defensively. What a terrific job. Footwork really excellent on a post play. Great play to take that to the basket. <laughs> on the dribble, gives it up. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot. He did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Launches away. I wonder if he's ever going to get any help from his teammates, Dick. He's doing it all and then some. Call this a one-man show, Brad. I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. He takes the pass in the paint. Tries the turn, and the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. Back it up, back it up. We'll see that one again. Gave it up. Chapman is feeling great right now. He may be in the zone right now, Brad. They look to get it to the inside. Double team now, bad angle. Stolen over. Fronts in first and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And he made an error, obviously. But they don't have the great respect of saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. Trying to feed inside. Picks off the pass. Showing great patience as he waits for the reset of the offense. He's got a pass it or make a play, Brad. Everything they throw up. Keeps hitting the target, NBN, nothing but nylon. I tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. Here's a double team. What a great steal. Defensive player was really right on top of that basketball. Easy one. That's an 8-0 run. 
Patience by the dribbler being shown as the offense is reset. They'll work it around the arc. The frustration right there. Looking for a good shot. There they come with a double team to stop it. Do they need a timeout here? Yeah, their voice is beginning to fade. See who will benefit the most out of that timeout, Dick. William fakes the shot. They go inside and now back outside. I tell you, inside outside action always works. Try to go inside. That was really a nonchalant pass. Get that sucker out of the game, man. <laughs> On the top of the circle, he drills it from beyond the arc. <laughs> Got to think right now. Got to focus defensively. And our trifecta for the Knights. Aaron Andrews on the sideline. With Dick Vitale. I'm Brad Nestle. Nice to have you along with us. Sinks it. <laughs> on the inside. Control of the ball. Burgess comes up with it. Up and inside. The center gets the ball for the bucket. Perfectly executed. Let's take a look at that last hoop. Both teams looking to get things going here. Pass down low. There's a drop step. And oh, good defense. I got defense reacting to beat him to the spot. Very poor job with the drop step. Very slow. The power forward takes the pass. There's the trap. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man. He looks at the hoop. Goes up for two. I tell you, terrific shot. Really impossible to get a piece of that baby. Great pressure, great double team, really explosive. The point guard gets the pass. Ball was knocked loose, but the offense got it back. Tries for two. Nice job of dribbling off the screen, but the shot just didn't fall. In the paint. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. Nice steal there, but the offense gets the ball back. Got a wide open look. He dials long distance. That's good. Picked off. On the dribble, gives it up with a long bomb. Gave it up for two. Doesn't go. Of that screen. Great play to take that to the basket. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Get that sucker out of the game, man. Number 33, supplying pressure and looking for the steal. You gotta be careful when you go for an aggressive steal like that, Brian. If you miss, you could be in trouble. Off the rim and no good. Got it. And 
and a momentary look from three-point land. Pushing that basketball. Stop and pop. He kept his dribble and ran the defender right off the screen for a beautiful jump shot, Brad. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. He fakes the shot. Down he goes, and no foul call either way. Wow, no call. I can't believe that one. Well, that's good defense. A steal on the inside. Oh, what a way to force the turnover. Great anticipation by the post player. Great anticipation defensively. The point guard takes the feed. Unloads a three. Dick, they are loving it behind that line. Hey, as long as you're hitting, the loving is good, baby. The power forward with the ball. And now they'll bring it up. From three-point range. Great job of freeing himself with the screen, but shot won't go. If there's a coach who's synonymous with greatness in winning, it's the head coach of the Raiders. Hey, definitely one of the all-time greats. Passionate, fiery guy who is still all about discipline. For the bucket, can't get the shot to drop. Too many dribbles and a steal. Chapman makes it goes in the foul. You talk about Will. This senior has it, baby. He was putting that in no matter what. Dick, that's what I call giving him the business. He's definitely giving him the business. I can do without that twatting, though. I can't emphasize it enough, Brad. It's important to get to the charity strike. Good. Fake. Chapman picks up the foul. First team foul. Let's go to the third member of our broadcast team. Here's Aaron Andrews. Well, Brad and Dick down here on the sidelines. It looks like the losing team is starting to get a little bit anxious. Their coaches are reminding them just to relax. My observation is it looks like these bright lights have gotten the best of this team so far in the first half. All right, thanks, Aaron. Both teams looking to get things going here. Moving it around the perimeter. Had him in the paint, but went elsewhere. Looks at the three. Great shot. He can't stay with it. He's got to get some help from his teammates on D. There's a nice block from behind, Dick. Yeah, that's good timing for the defense. Looking for a good shot. Goes up for two. In and out. Great possibility coming. Tries for two. Perfectly executed. Entry pass in the paint. He attempts a jump hook. I'll tell you, great job protecting the basketball, getting deep post position, and the jump hook is so effective. Your defense, they're going for some aggressive steals as well. Count that as a personal foul. Oh, and this packed house is showing their appreciation for their team. Well, there's euphoria out there. They're really excited. They're going bananas. For the 
bucket. Unbelievable. Look at that post position. He can't get a piece of that, baby. Oh, what a strip, Red. Hilton draws. Count it and the foul. That's how he likes it, baby. What a great play. Check him out, Nick. He's taunting the crowd. You've got that right, Brad. The Wolfpacks go to the line for the first time in this game. Count it. the perimeter high post screen gonna use it now they work it around the perimeter there he is puts the ball loose alley -oop. goes up for two they just can't seem to miss they've had a serious stroke with their shooting Brad the dribble gives it up turns it over lets it fly he gets the bucket that's a nine nothing run they work the perimeter gave it up wow what hops baby what hops here's one more look at it Go inside and now back outside. I tell you, inside outside action always works. Set that screen away. Tries to turn and the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. Got the high pick. On the outside. They work it around the perimeter. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's a no no, baby. Defensive player beats. Him. Here's a block from behind. My man was on a mission. Great screen set up, but the shot won't go. Tries for two. Great play to take that to the basket. For two. Perfectly executed. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Then a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. There appears to be a mismatch in the post. Let's see if they can get him the ball. Another turnover. And they're not talking out the turnovers either. I step in it, man. Take a look right here. Little burst to go up in shorts. Little ballerina hanging in the air. He's a jack of all trades. Only one basket away from the crowd being absolutely thrilled. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Puts up the shot. It's good. <laughs> he fires from long range. Buried it. Let's go to the videotape for that one. Basketball got a little too fancy, too much mustard there, baby. Take a look right here. Nobody steps into the driving lane. 
He allows him to get the push the lane, the angle. Up and inside. He tries the three. He gets that one to fall. It's stolen. Ball was loose, but the defense got possession. Sinks the shot. I want to see that again. Gives it up for the bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. Watch the replay coming up. Had a momentary look from three-point land. And working around the perimeter. He wants a three. Scorches the net. Pull-up jumper from way out. Sinks it. Work the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. Nice fake. Goes up for two. Perfectly executed. off the lazy pass. Kicks it out. He shoots from outside. Texas Tech is showing a bit of a run here. Things are going their way right now. Rejects it. Moving it around the perimeter. Leans in. And he scores despite the hack. <laughs> Takes the pass in the paint. There's a double team waiting there. He shoots from long range. Oh, yes. Jumped in front to take it away. two. They still don't score. Great defensive play. Anticipating well. When you're an anticipator, you got a chance to do well. A lot of guys, they're reactors. If you're a reactor, you're one step behind the action. Great play to take that to the basket. Shot clock is dead. Gave it up on the dribble. Gives it up. Picked out of the air. Now they work it around the perimeter. Gave it up in the paint. He attempts the three. Way off target. He tries to beat the clock. Misses from way outside. At the half, the Red Raiders are ahead by five. Best play of that half. Let's take another look. Texas Tech is showing some deadly accuracy from the field in the first half. Hey, for sure, Brad, this kind of accuracy can easily be carried over to the second half if they continue to be patient with the rock. Patience and poise usually equals points. 
Nick, what's going through these young guys' minds now? Here they are. They've worked all season long just to get to the NCAA tournament. We've got a half behind us, a half to go, and somebody's got to go home. Well, you know what I really think is impressive here tonight? Both these clubs are really focused on each possession. You can feel that they're playing with so much concentration, and that's all they got to do. they got to play up to their ability, and they're both doing it. At the ultimate end, it's going to come down to who makes the big shot. The power, he rejects it. The Wolf Packs have got to continue to get him the ball. That he's on fire. Defender the ball loose, but the offense got it back. For the bucket. Perfectly executed. Drips him clean. Knocks it down. Here's the toss back out from the post. I tell you, coach's dream when your post player can be an exceptional passer. Dickey's going to go up strong. Oh, that's a terrific post play. Didn't waste any time attacking the basket. Entry pass in the paint. Dick, not a bad drop step, but it doesn't work for him. I tell you, just doesn't beat him to the basket. Not quick enough. And a great reaction by the defensive post player. On the outside. There's the pick. There's the roll. He makes the block. And the ball goes out of play. Dick, how's that backcourt comparison shaping up, Ethan? Hey, Brad, that's a question that these coaches should be asking themselves. How can they, as coaches, get the most out of their guards? Are they quick enough to pressure the opponent, or offensively, can they create off the dribble? To me, it's about finding the weaknesses and attacking them. NC State have a nice little run going here. Can they keep it up, though? No one's proven otherwise just yet, Brad. That's going to be a backcourt violation, Dick. Hey, the defense did their job, baby. That's probably why you're out of coaching. Too many points off turnovers. I'll tell you one thing. That leads you to the exit side. No question. You get the Ziggy. I'll tell you, you got to protect the basketball. You can't turn it over. <laughs> the Ziggy. I love that. Tries for two. He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. Defensively doing a great job down there, and he's winning that battle there. I think it's very essential that you establish post position by moving that offensive player out, and that's how he's winning that battle. Stolen ball. Gonna muscle it on the inside. What an explosive move to the goal. No wasted time. He had his mind made up. He was attacking the basket. Take it away. And again, they look to run. Chapman's receiving a lot of support from the fans. Yeah, they really know how to show their appreciation for him. With the catch. Not he posterized them. Dick, it's really been a while since I've seen a team shoot like this. Hey, every once in a while you get a squad that gets on a tier and simply makes your jaw drop. It's fun to watch, isn't it, Brad? With one attempt. Hits that one. Defensive guy now is gaining position down there on the low block, Dick. I tell you, he gained big time position by getting the good angle, the good arm entry, had the real extension. Great play to take that to the basket. Looking for a good shot. Takes the pass in the paint. Trying to draw some contact. 
He puts it in with contact and all. Here's a double team. He attempts the three, makes it. The Wolf Packs of a mismatch in the post. Can we get him the ball, though? Hill receives the pass. Oh, right, right there. They missed him inside. You got to get the ball when a guy is open. That's a special mark. Feeding the post. Oh, the cheerleaders into it big time for their team. They are really involved. I'll tell you one thing. They bring a lot of spirit. They work it around the perimeter. From the baseline, they'll bring it out on top. He looks for three. They're nailing three balls at will right now. They're really hurting them with the three-point shooting. For two. Good there, that's more like my stuff. Wow. Little Barishnikov right there. You always were a dancer. <laughs> Looking for a screen on top and got it. The Wolfpack are down by 16. The power forward handles the feed. There's the trap. He takes it away. Here we go on the break. Way out on top, controlling the ball. We'll get another look at it. it up. He unloads a three. Rims out. Goes for the steal down low and he didn't get it. I think he took a chance and he lost, baby. Let's go courtside. What do you got for us, Aaron? Well, guys, the battle in the paint has played a major factor in this game and is probably some of the reason why they have this lead. If things don't change in a hurry, this game could get ugly, guys. All right, thanks, Aaron. I'll tell you, Aaron's exactly right. Post play is essential if you're going to be effective. The shooting guard handles the pass. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. He gets the shot to fall. Working it around the perimeter. He fires from long range. Off the rim and no good. They work the perimeter. And we've got a whistle and a foul. I've seen you out there with pom-poms, Mr. Vitale, but not looking that good. I tell you what, don't look that good. I can't dance like that, baby. have the good angle. They should have got it to him about a second earlier. Foul charge. Well, Mr. Vital, let's take a look at our backcourt production. Hey, I'll tell you one thing, Brad. You look at the stats, you want to find out if your backcourt is playing well. Well, you want to ensure that your guards keep the number of turnovers down. That's a must. Reduce turnovers. So many games are won and lost by teams turning the ball over. Turnovers, missed opportunities happen, baby, when you turn the rock over. We're going to move it around the perimeter. Fakes it. The ball goes out of bounds. Isolated on the outside. They work it around the arc, looking for the open jumper. Looking for the foul. Basket falls despite the contact.
just about ready for play to resume. Squares up down on the low block. I tell you, teach your player to face up. You get in triple threat position. You can drive, shoot, or you can pass. Intercepted. For the deuce. Perfectly executed. On the outside. Gave it up. In the paint. Goes up for two. I tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. Great job of running the defender into the screen for the nice J. From three point land, way off target. Goes with a baby hook. I'll tell you, great shot. I don't understand why it's not utilized more often. It's so impossible to block that shot. It's stolen. Change in possession. The defense knocked it loose, then went and got it. That's 11 unanswered. I wouldn't be surprised if they changed things up a little bit, Brad. Let's watch the defense down on the low block. See, first initially he wants a three-quarter. Then he plays him where he gets good post position, so he's able to get the ball. The good rebound in position, a good block out. And that's essential in the post. A lot of guys don't realize part of post play is ultimately a block out and get good rebound position. Tries to turn, the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. And he'll kick it back outside. Picks off the lazy pass. Got a man in high post. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in. Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. NC State are on a run right here as of late, Dick. Yeah, they've started to put it together on offense. Can they keep it together, though? That is the question. Looking for contact. Great play to take that to the basket. The offense gaining great post position down low. Absolutely. Getting the good inside angle, a poor job defensively, no help. I mean, that is post play at its best. They'll work it around the arc. Jumped in front to take it away. Gordon pounded on his way up. Oh, and he's not going to be happy with that call. Well, it's silly foul right there, but look at his face. His facial expression tells it all. He goes to the line for the first time. He buries it. Gets two at the charity strike. Up and inside. Had a guy in the post, but elected to reverse the ball. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. Looks like all they can look forward to is next season, Dick, because uh, one team's been dominant throughout this ballgame. It doesn't look like it's going to change. Well, it comes down to one simple thought. You better execute at the end, or your season is over, baby. It's over, and no coach wants it to end now. Sinks it. It. 
They still don't score. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. Now they work it around the perimeter. Way out on top. Controlling the ball. Contact causes the shot to come off. He shows the sweet touch. Goes up for two. Perfectly executed. For the bucket. And he missed. Robs him of the ball. Looking for a good shot. Decided against the open post and reverses the ball. He makes the shot. The Wolfpack trail by 17. side he comes away with it ball comes back out from the post I tell you Brad you gotta have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man he can't get the J to go despite running off the nice screen takes away the pass Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot, and he did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Nice low post play. Good entry to the box. it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. Nope. The senior's going to take a trip to the line and get the basket, Dick. That senior determination in a big game, Brad. What a play. These kids are fired up now. And if you're going to celebrate, why not celebrate with a teammate? Hey, hey, why not? It's a team sport, right? Sinks it. They're making good use of their free throw opportunities tonight. Good free throw shooting teams seem to always give themselves a chance to win. Stolen ball. Transition opportunity coming up. This team right now just lighting it up from everywhere. Hey, they're finding each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. Puts it up looking for contact. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Here he comes defensively on him on the low block, Dick. I'll tell you, three-quarter position, trying to deny, but then he does a great job in post position and spreading his body and getting the ball. There's a whistle and a foul on the inside. What a great job of putting the ball to the floor and attacking the basket, taking advantage of a slow post play. Accepted. He gets that one to fall. Tries for two. Finger roll. Wait a minute. Let's replay that one. Working it around the perimeter. On the dribble, gives it up. Picked out of the air. Isolated on the outside. They work it around the arc. 
Looking for the open jumper. And they come with a double team to stop it. Let's it fly. Off the rim and no good. Dickey's really sticking to his man defensively down there. I tell you, doing a great job fronting him, trying to beat him to the spot, playing in front, making him throw the lob pass over the top. If you get help, you can take that pass away. Trying to draw the foul. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. Picked off. Pushes it up. Stolen. They work the perimeter. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Looking for a good shot. Top of the circle. Goes. He's going to see this guy to sleep tonight, Dick. He's already living the nightmare, Brad. from outside. He nails the bucket. They work it around the arc with the fake. He unloads. They let him get into a rhythm. Nick, they're doing a great job defending. I tell you, what a great job at a defensive player. He's winning the battle on the interior because he's beating him to the spot. That one's blocked from behind. Great rotation by the D. I love it. Work it inside, and he tries a drop step. Defensively, nice job. Uh, great job using his footwork defensively to beat him to the spot. fake he shoots from the low post off the rim and no good now they work it around the perimeter gave it up double team now that angle he shoots from right of the circle the Red Raiders have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment they need to keep feeding the ball it's simple He's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing them off. That spin move's not going to work against the defense like that. I'll tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. Takes the pass in the paint. Ten on the shot clock. This whole team that's on the floor is quick. But so is the defense, and they do a nice job. Ball down low, but it's kicked out. He hits it. Takes it off him. Step, but it doesn't work for him. Ate just doesn't beat him to the basket. Not quick enough. And a great reaction by the defensive post play. Dick, I think we saw a good tournament game. Both teams played pretty well. And, you know, I, I feel bad for the team that's got to go home. Well, the better team won because they protected the basketball. They made sure they converted on the free throw line. They did all the little intangibles we talked about. And that was the difference in the game.
Mr. Vitale, how about that State Farm drive of the game? Oh, Mr. Nestle, this one's superb. The ability to get close enough to the basket and then have the presence of mind to finish off the great play. Wow, what a play. The Red Raiders open.